Welcome second graders. We are going to continue with our code.org today. Some of you have done two lessons, some of you have only done one, so I'm going to skip ahead to the third lesson. Um, it's only so that everybody's on the same page and it will make life a little bit easier for everybody. Um, this is called collecting lesson six, collecting treasures with Laurel. So you're going to order movement commands as a, as sequential steps in a program, represent an algorithm as a computer program, and develop problem solving and critical thinking skills by reviewing and debugging programs. Remember, debugging and critical problem solving, critical thinking skills, those are really necessary when you're doing your math, when you're doing life. So we need to have those skills, those problem solving skills. Okay, your first word is algorithm. What word? It's a list of steps to find a t finish a task. Next word is program. What word? An algorithm that has been coded into something that can be run by a machine. And then the last word for today is programming. What word? The art of creating a program. So we're going to watch our video first like we've done in the past. Let me make this bigger. Okay, I'm going to log out of this version because you know this is the Explorer one that doesn't always work right and it doesn't help you where you're going. What you need to do is, if you have Google Chrome, click on your Google Chrome. If you don't have the icon, please click the window at the bottom. And then you see over here to the right, the browsers that say um, Chrome. Click on that. Log into your My Sarasota account with your N number, PIN number. Remember, I'm on the instruction tabs, so you're either going to do I1 or I2, and then find CODE. Let me get to your grouping. Your course C. Now remember, mine always looks a little bit different than yours, so just bear with me. Okay, so we already watched the video, we're good. And you guys remember, if we've watched the video together, you don't have to watch it again. And this looks like a lot of circles. So you may want to break this up into a couple of days. Okay, do what you got to do to make sure that you are not overly stressed. Okay, if you are becoming stressed out and you need a break, then turn it off. Come back to it later. No big deal. Okay, please don't think that you have to get everything done today. You really don't. Okay, this says, do you see some new blocks in the toolbox? Don't worry, we'll show you how to use them in another lesson. So I'm not going to use this one today or with this lesson. Let's see what it says. Okay, so really all you have to do, if you look at the picture, I only need to move forward, collect, and I have my one. So I'm going to just do that. Now some of you will be, some of you will be really industrious and want to get all of them, and you're more than welcome to. This is a free play area. 
You don't have to sit here and get all of them though. It says to get one. So I got my one. So I'm gonna to go to number three. Okay, that's easy. We count one, two, three, four. She actually has to be on the block with the treasure in order to collect it, okay? So I'm gonna make sure I'm right first. Two, three, four. Okay, I'm there. I don't have my goal yet, but remember that's okay. I'm gonna press reset, and now I'm gonna put my collect button in. And then I'm gonna press run. Okay, good to go. Okay, here we go. Okay, so I'm going to take them and I'm going to move them over here to get them out of the way since I have to put them in the right order, just like in reading when they ask you to put sequencing steps in order. Well, the first thing I know I got to do is move forward because that's obvious. So that's going to put me here and then it looks like I need another move forward. So I'm going to run that, make sure that's right. Okay, that's good. Now I need to turn. The only turn they gave me was this one. And then move forward and collect. Reset, run. Okay, pull them all out to do that one because otherwise you're gonna be sitting here, you know, trying to move them around and then they're gonna get lost. Oh, some more. Let's see what this one says. Okay, well, let's just move this pile over. Now, these ones, though, it looks like I can delete these because they're blue. The first one, obviously, I need to do is a move forward. So that's going to get me here. So if I step, I'm facing one direction, I need to turn. And in this case, I need to turn right. And then I have two move forwards. Reset, run. Okay, remember the key is small bits of code. We're not trying to write the whole thing out at one time. I'm gonna do a little bit, make sure I'm correct. Press reset, I can press that 300 times if I need to. And go from there, turn left. I forgot where I was, let me figure out where I am now. Okay, so then it looks like two more move forwards and then the collect. Okay, so we should be done now. Please, 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 to keep your sanity and to keep you from stressing out, do no more than two or three lines. Press run, check it. If it's not right, what did you do wrong? Did you turn wrong? Did you go too far forward? Figure that out. Don't sit here and try to do the whole thing at one time. Okay, well, I can tell you right now, the second block isn't going to be a collect. So I'm going to pull it out. And that one's not going to be a collect either. Move forward. Okay, that'll put me one, two, then I need to turn. They only gave me one turn. So let me see where I am now. Okay, then I've got one, two move forwards. And a collect. Then a move forward and a collect. Okay, I'm going to do one more, and that'll be half of what you have. And then you guys can go from there. Yes, you have to do the ones I've already done. 
But again, you can go back to this and look and see where you may have made a mistake, what you need help with, and go from there. Okay, let's see what happens. I just want to see what happens. Okay, so right away that turn is wrong. But you know what? I got a left turn right here. So I'm just going to grab that one. Okay, that worked. Uh, I need to move forward. And then a turn. So I'm assuming it's going to be that turn, but let's find out. Okay. Move forward, collect, move forward. Oh, this is the right order. Okay. Remember your code that you just wrote is all of this right here. Only we're not using the JavaScript, we're using Blockly. Now, if you need help, I'll do this one too. It's a challenge. I'll stop and do this one. But if you guys really get stuck and you need help, the there is a parent letter that went home or got emailed about office hours. You can call me. Let me know. Ask your parents to call me. Don't just call me. And I will try to help you through the problems that you're having. So let's see where we are. There's some missing because it says 11 out of 16. So I'm missing 6 minus 1 is 5 blocks. Okay. Uh, here she is. And she's got three move forwards. And each one should have a collect. So I'm going to put a collect here. Okay, that gets me closer. Let's see what happens. Mm. Okay, I'm just going to sit here and do this. Turn right. Forward. I need two forwards there. Okay, let's reset it. Run. Again, this is a challenge. It's supposed to help you. Get to the right place. Let go. Let's see if that's right. I'm not sure. Ooh, it's not a right, is it? It's a left. And I still need to move forward. So I was looking at my blocks going, I'm still short one block. So I was like, I still have room. That's why I wasn't sure if I was right or not. Okay. Um, when you guys, if you do have questions, I can look at what you're doing. So it's not like I'm looking at a blank at my screen here and trying to figure it out. I can literally go in and look at what you are doing. So just call me any um, during the office hours and I will see if I can help you. But I'm leaving these last ones for you. If you get done and you would like to try the extra lessons, you're more than welcome to if you still have time. If you don't have time today, please don't do them today. If you have any time, any extra time during the weeks and you want to have to do those, you're more than welcome to. I'm not requiring them, but some people finish really quickly and want just a little bit more of a challenge. That's it for this lesson. See you later.